Okay, so let's continue now with uh, uh, slide 11, uh, sense organs, uh, dealing with uh, first the uh, general senses, and then uh, we're gonna then we'll move on to the special senses. All right, uh, starting with pain. Now, some people might not consider pain to be a sense, but it certainly is, and um, and it's really important. And so sometimes we'll think, well, wouldn't it be great to not to have uh, pain, and it's actually a medical condition where some people cannot feel pain at all, but it's a really precarious uh, condition because pain is a warning that, uh, that you've I uh, injured something and you should t take it easy and, and not use that in uh, that particular part of your body. Okay, projection pathway. Uh, to the cerebral cortex uh, by way of the reticular formation, thalamus, and the collateral to the limbic system. And the collateral to the limbic system actually bypasses the thalamus. It's the, um, as I said, most, almost all senses go through the thalamus. Um, uh, smell does not, and this one pain pathway does not. All the rest do. And then we're also going to be talking about uh, CNS modulation, a natural analgesic pathway. Uh, now, the projection pathways are ascending. And this natural energetic pathway is descending, and it, has, it actually uh, is a pain relieving. It's called, called spinal gating, and uh, from the cerebral cortex and hypothalamus, the info to the central gray matter of the midbrain, which projects the reticular formation of medulla oblongata. I'm going to show you that later on. In fact, I put in a new slide here with a couple of slides uh, showing you the spinal gating system. So here's slide 12 showing the projection pathway for pain. And remember, the, uh, the receptors for pain are called nociceptors. And uh, they are really just like, just regular like nerve endings that get damaged and uh, fire up a receptor potential. It goes along a first order neuron. Now, usually we're gonna have to learn something about this, more about the spinal cord, about ascending pathways. And that's sensory, is ascending. And uh, the, the, where the receptors are located are on a second order, uh, or in a first order nerve fiber right here, first order. It goes into the spinal cord, and synapses upon the, uh, the uh, cell bodies of the second order neurons. The second order ner uh, neurons decussate in the spinal cord and go ascend up to the brain. And there's uh, two pathways, the usual, the, uh, pathway we usually think about is this pathway right here, second order, to the thalamus. This one goes to the thalamus. And then the third order uh, uh, neurons, and, and almost all the third order neurons in every sense, are their cell bodies are in the thalamus. And uh, the second order synapses upon the third order in the thalamus, and then the thalamus, and then that third order fibers go to the primary somerset some aesthetic cortex where you actually feel the sensation of pain. This other pathway is uh, unusual for, uh, for pain. Usually there's only one pathway for these senses, but for pain has this second pathway here where the, um, that goes to the reticular formation and uh, uh, the third order neuron is, uh, cell bodies actually in the reticular formation in the medulla oblongata. And then this is a branching more uh, a sensory neuron that sends one branch to the somesthetic cortex where you feel the pain, and then a collateral to the hypothalamus and limbic system for the visceral and emotional response to pain, right? Um, and this is the one that uh, bypasses the thalamus. Okay, slide 13, the spinal gaining. Neurons from medulla oblongata predict the dorsal runs of the spinal cord. Now, this is a descending pathway. It's not really mo a motor, and most descending pathways are motor, but this one is actually an inhibitory pathway that's going to inhibit pain. Uh, and I'm going to show you that in the next slide. Um, after I first introduced the chemical senses, so we're going from, uh, we're jumping from the, uh, from the general senses now to the first of the special senses. Uh, uh, gustation, which is another na name for taste. Uh, and this is the chemical senses because these receptors 
uh, detect chemicals. They're, they, they're, they're ke uh, chemoreceptors, really. Um, and they are taste receptors at the base of the tongue papillae, uh, taste buds. And we'll talk about uh, taste in a moment. But first, I'm going to put up a new slide here, slide 14, that, uh, that uh, shows the spinal gating pattern. Now pay attention to this slide because this slide is not actually in the in the PowerPoint that's up in uh, D2O. I added this just a, a few days ago. But <clears throat> here to the to the right, you can see the the ascending pathway of uh, for pain through through the thalamus, and then uh, the other pathway they don't show you goes up to here to, to the hypothalamus and limbic system, and then the then there are uh, nerve, uh, nerve fibers that come from cerebral cortex and hypothalamus through the midbrain to the medulla oblongata, down the spinal cord, and actually stimulate inhibitory neurons. And uh, as you can see, the substance P here in green, that's a pain um, neurotransmitter. So, so you see that's being secreted onto this second order neuron from the first order neuron. Well, what, uh, what happens with the spinal gating is uh, this uh, turns on um, serotonin and, and encephalins and actually will, uh, will inhibit. Uh, th so this cell is turning on this inhibitory neuron, which inhibits the second order neuron by secreting encephalin. And down here, uh, this will uh, 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 inhibit the first order neuron from secreting substance P by presynaptic inhibition. Remember, we spoke about presynaptic inhibition uh, uh, in the uh, uh, nerve tissue chapter. And this, this causes a dulling of pain. So you often notice that when you first injure yourself, it's a really sharp pain, and then you withdraw your hand. And then that sharp pain subsides it, after a little bit, and then it just becomes more like a dull ache. And that's due to this spinal gating pathway, natural pain relief. Okay, slide 15, just showing you tongue and where the, the 